fishing, just fishing, fishing, just fishing. Chicken jerks, chicken jerks, chicken jerks, fish. Chicken jerks, chicken jerks, just fishing. Chicken jerks, chicken jerks, chicken jerks, fish. Chicken jerks, chicken jerks, just fishing. Chicken jerks, chicken jerks, chicken jerks, fish. Chicken jerks, chicken jerks. All right, here we go, guys. An August 10th, 2020 trip with my customer Scott, his dad Bill, and their good friends Rocco and Bob. And the the thing that I'm going to remember about this trip is game planning. It's always important to have in your mind what you're going to do. On this day, and you'll hear it right at the beginning, we knew there were going to be strong winds. And it's a 45-mile run for us from Greenport and Eastern Long Island, where I'm docked, to Block Island, where you know, we were going to fish. And Montauk had been pretty dead the last couple of weeks. We were catching fish at Block, so the decision was made. If we can get to Block, we got to get to Block. And we knew we were going to have a three-hour window. We were leaving at 6, expected arrival time around 7.30. We needed to be out of Block by 10.30. The winds were 10 to 15, but they were going to pick up over 20. The seas were going to build, too. We did not want to be there and be 45 miles away from home in that heavy weather. And it worked out perfectly. The the second part of the plan was we knew we were going to get there around slack. We were going to drift naturally as long as we could. There was going to be wind to help us. But then we were going to be in a wind against tide situation. We were going to use the trolling motor to help us. And we wound up with 13 keepers in three hours at block. We're not going to show any of the Montauk fish, just the block fish. But we did run. We left 10.30. We were back on the north side of Montauk at about 11.15. We finished the day there. I believe we had seven more keepers We had an easy limit, Uh, we released fish, but the important thing was we had a game plan and we stuck to it. As always, if you like these videos, hit that like button. And if you're not already a subscriber and you like content like this, please hit that subscribe button. Rhode Island waters, but we gotta follow New York rules and we just got here. Bob here just dropped down. I I didn't even have the camera on yet. Everybody's ringing up. These guys just dropped, another guy's. So who do we have? Bob, Bob with the first keeper. The first Billy just dropped. We got Rocky. There's there's Rocky and Scott's over there. Scott booked the trip. Scott is uh, Scott. Scott is uh, Billy's son. The so Rocky and Bob, any relation? Staten no. Island. Just no. Staten Island. Okay, all Staten Island yeah. guys. All right. Good start. Check it in a second. At first fish. Scott's still not in the water, and Rocky's on. Good fish. He's saying, "What kind of rod is that?" The Iowa protein. Whoa, it's a nice fish, huh? That ain't a bad fish. comes. Good job. Another keeper. That'll do it. Right. Yeah. Yeah, slack it off. Thank you. Another 22, I think. Maybe bigger. 20. Yeah, 22 on the nose. Oh. Oh, this is unbelievable. You're still not in the water. Uh, grab one of my poles. They're, they're all rigged. Just grab any of them. How's it feel? Very big. Yeah, that's the that's battalion. That's what stiff rock is. Okay. Penn battalion, huh? That looks like a sea bass, though, to me. I don't know. I hope I'm wrong. It's not flapping like it. No, it is. No, it's a sea bass. It's a keeper. Sorry. No, you're good, you're good, you're good. Should be. It's got to be 15. All right, don't worry. Yeah, it's easily a keeper. Another fluke. Scott, get in the water, buddy. Scotty, what hey, hey, no cursing! How does this feel? Excellent. Oh, it's a fluke. Oh, yeah. See the head shake. Oh, yeah. All right, guys, this is why we ran 45 miles, by the way. Okay. There it is. This is the fluke. Oh, nice fluke. Oh, this is a nice one. Biggest one so far. Oh, oh, that's a little door, man. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. It's like, yeah. Oh, yeah. 24, 25. This is, this is, no more. That's a picture. 26. 
Oh, more than 26. 27 and change. Yeah, that does look like 28 Yeah, 27 and change. Yeah, this is a seven pound fish plus maybe. Wow. I got the boga. We'll take a quick weight too. It's got shoulders. Oh, it does. No, no, it's a piece of string. It's from the... I'm gonna say seven and a half. Nice fish. Nope. I'm wrong. Eight. <laughs> Whoa, there we go. Eight, eight pound. You want me to take a picture with you Absolutely, over here? Please. You're gonna have to text it to me later. Yep. Scott's on a, hopefully a keeper. Yeah? I think so. It's a good one. Okay. Oh, yeah. Might have to. That's definitely a keeper. Let out some line. It's slack right now. We gotta we gotta wait for the current and then use the trolling motor to help us either stem it or. I'm bouncing. Oh, there you go. You're on. Good job. Yeah, and that was a a Rick set over there, by the way. See if this fish stays on. I'm not confident it's gonna stay on. By the way, if it stays on, that's second keeper here, second trip. Fluky? Yep, right there, Captain. Right. A little more? All right, good job. All right. Good job. Leave this here for a second. Hit, right? Yeah, I did. I got that on film. And this is going to be part two of the game plan. Um, we had, I believe, six fish at this point through two or three drifts, and we decided to drop the trolling motor. The guys were using five and six ounce weights. The current started moving the other way. They started scoping more, and we were going to use the trolling motor to help us correct that. Oh! 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 Go right back down. <laughs> so when we catch a nice fish when the trolling motor's working we call it a trolling motor fish trolling motor fish it's got weight huh oh he's got some weight that's a fluke for sure huh? don't drop oh let me get the big net bigger than the first one uh yes all right, well, the first one was eight pounds. Oh, beautiful fish, dude. <laughs> Might be a double, nine at least. Wow. Wow. Nice fish. 29 inch fish. No. Eight. Eight, eight and change. Like I, I bounced it on their head and yeah I mean I have a two ounce on here we go there we go right when I said that too I got it don't worry you guys fish I might need somebody to help me with the net. This is a big fish. <laughs> no, I got I got a pretty big fish on. No, you just use a small net. Just use a small net. It is what it is. If we lose it, we lose it. I, that's gonna take an hour to uh, I mean it's a big fish. Swim them right into it. There you go. Thank you. Yeah, I got it. I got it. Fish, fish, fish. I got it. Thank fish, you. Fish. Appreciate the help. I was going to net it myself, and then I saw it. I'm like, uh, that's going to be a little tricky. <laughs> yeah, 
yeah. So, so we just retied Rocky, uh, Billy there, and as we were dropping him down, Billy, 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 ah, uh, Bobby, 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 what the hell is wrong with me? And uh, Mr. Scott, got your name right. You're the one paying me, so I better get your name right. Scott hooked up to a nice fish. Still have the trolling motor down. Let's see what we got here. Nice fish, man. Big fish, big fish, big fish, big fish. All right, let's just do this smart. All right, lead them back to me. I don't want to. I don't. I mean, I don't want to do a tail first. Shoot. Yeah. Yeah. Lead them. Lead them into the net. I don't want to get them tail first. All right, let him go. Let him go. Let him. Yep. He's hooked well. Not really, but we got him. Oh, nice. Yeah. That was oh, in it. Yeah. That was an adventure. Thank you, pal. Oh yeah. I'm gonna catch a lot of flack for that net job. But that, by the way, that's why you never want to get him net. I was trying to spin him for you. Yeah. That's why you never want to get him tail first. Thank you very much. Oh yeah. Thank you very much, sir. Oh my God. And yeah, that was an egregious net fail. I even said to Scott, I don't want to net him tail first. And yet, what do I do? I try to net him tail first. Lesson learned, you know, you don't want that fish to have an opportunity to jump out of the net. If you net him head first, when they try to swim away, they typically, not always, but nine out of 10 times, they'll swim right into the net meshing. You do it tail first, they have an easier opportunity to swim forward and jump out of the net, exactly what this fish did. Let's see if he comes back. Okay, I'm coming with the net. Good one? Okay. Big net? Okay. You're good. Nice and easy. Sure it's not a big skate, right? Oh, no, no, it's a fluke. I just saw the head shakes. Stay on. Let's not embarrass ourselves uh, with the net either. Scott, kidding. It's the trolling. Oh, nice. I can't see it yet. Oh, there it is. Yep, I see it. Another big fish. Oh boy. Slack. Yep. Yeah, baby. We only like the big one. Hey. Yeah, baby. Crocky. Thank you, John. Way to go, Rock. Thank you, Billy. Yeah, but Bill, don't, don't wait. There you go. You got him. There you go. Come Come in with the net. Ooh. Yep, yep. <laughs> Believe it or not, I was just reeling up and I got hit. <laughs> He's got him. Nice uh, rod bend on that. Oh. oh no. <laughs> open the bell. Just open and keep it open. I'll, I'll Hold on, man. keep it open. Open what? it up. What do we got there? Nice fluke. Yeah. Guide him into the net. Pull him this way. All right. Let me help. I Just putting him. I got it. No big deal. Oh. oh. Fluke? No. Uh, I think it's a fluke. I think it's a fluke. What do you guys think? I thought I saw some head shake. I mean, the, the sea bass will fool you. Coming around you? We're good. It's a fluke. That's a keeper for sure. Nice. Side number three. Yeah. Give me some slack, Billy. Just and as I said in the opening, our game plan was 10.30 we were leaving. This fish was caught right before 10.30. That was going to be the last fish we caught at block. And you'll see some footage here. We caught uh, six or seven more keepers on the north side of Montauk. Finished the day with a full limit, only retaining our limit. Great day, great guys. I'm going to see them again for Blackfish. We're booked for next year. As always, if you like these videos, hit that like button. And if you're not already a subscriber and you like content like this, please hit that subscribe button.